guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Yasmin, and I'm a 17 year old mom to my baby Layla. This is my friend Sky, who's gonna be doing a video with me. I met Sky um, last year, she went to my school. Today, we're going to be doing some holiday baking. So, we're gonna be baking Yay. some eggnog cookies. All right, so we got almost everything we need we got eggnog, and we got all these other ingredients down here. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? It's, <laughs> it's Christmas time. We're making eggnog cookies. That's just Nick the pig well, goddess no, judging me cool. behind the camera. <laughs> we have eggnog, sugar, powdered sugar, whatever caro syrup is, flour, nutmeg, and marshmallows for hot chocolate, and then just other regular baking stuff. Can't find the baking soda. So slight dilemma. <laughs> but we'll be back. I'll show you that. Stay tuned. <clears throat> Couldn't find the baking soda. So we're gonna go ahead and start this and then wait to hear back from my aunt about that and see if we can find some at some point. So here she is. Hello? Okay, sorry. Hey. That's okay. Um we can't find the baking soda. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye. Okay. No, she can make noises. Okay, I do want a marshmallow. Were you offering me a marshmallow? I was. <laughs> nice. I caught it. I forgot that I was <laughs> Okay, so we don't have baking soda, but you can replace baking soda with baking powder. There's some formula that we're gonna find out how to do that with. So for this recipe, if you guys wanna make it with us, you need softened butter. Sugar. Oh, I really hope we have butter. <laughs> so, you need one cup of softened butter, a cup of sugar, a cup of eggnog. We get the Southern Comfort vanilla spice flavored eggnog because it's the best eggnog, according to Nick. <laughs> one egg beaten, three and three fourths cups of flour, a teaspoon of baking powder, or is it a teaspoon? A teaspoon? A teaspoon? A teaspoon? A teaspoon? A teaspoon of baking powder, a teaspoon of baking soda, Half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of nutmeg, and then you make the frosting, which we'll show you how to do as well. Okay, so first, none of us know how to bake, by the way. We're sort of going with this right now. Wait, can I just stick it in there? Don't wait. Yeah, just, no, Yasmin, did it say soften it? I'm putting it in a bowl. Did it yeah, say it's soften a soft it? Yeah. You don't like or like it? I don't care. That's not how it works. That is how you soften it. You don't put it in the microwave to soften it? That's what I do. That's not what you do. You just, uh, okay, Nick knows how to bake. Apparently, I don't know how to bake. I thought I could, but apparently, I don't I thought you just had to read the directions. you don't like me, do you? This is Sky's <laughs> first time meeting Layla. It's Sky. Hello. Little angel. <laughs> yeah, just stuck the stick jumper on in there. I'm gonna put them in this bowl right here. Go. <laughs> Okay, life hack, if your butter's not softened, use a potato masher to mash it. Soften it. It's not going too well. <laughs> okay, mix the other butter and sugar. Next, we need sugar. one cup of sugar. I can only find this one third cup thing, so we're going to be doing three of these. Big math skills right there. One. So someone's coming over to send us some pictures from a photo shoot. Hey Sean, what's up? We're vlogging baking right now. Oh my goodness, no way. <laughs> this is my professional official photographer, Sean. Come say hi to the vlog, Sean. Hi. It's on the side. Hello vlog. <laughs> Sean. <laughs> I'm professional. All right, so we got the sugar in there. What's so next? Eggnog. No, oh yes, add an eggnog and egg. So we have to beat an egg. <laughs> there you go. You can use there though. Does that even crack this egg in here? Yeah. Good. I beat yeah. this thing. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Oh, this is hats. so bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, next step. Okay, so next. 
Oh, eggnog and egg. She's never had eggnog, so we're gonna do a little taste test. Here, try a sip. It's just a... This one's super sick of your reflection in the It's delicious, right? It's like sweet. Oh my god. I feel like I just drank a cup of Christmas. We need a cup, so this is a third cup. Don't tell me you're doing three thirds cups. I'm sorry, I don't have a lot of cup measurements. This is not a baking channel. <laughs> you told me to get a cup. Whoa, there. <laughs> There's <see>. literally ingredients <laughs> everywhere. Delicious. <laughs> and eggnog, add flour, baking powder. Wait, so pretty much just add all the ingredients? That's pretty much all they're trying us to do. I don't know. Bro, you need to mix that yeah, together it's... more. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god. Do you want me to mix it for you? I'm really good at mixing. And they can just sort of show off to the fans so you can start vlogging. No, it's just checking me out. This so looks chunky. like mashed potatoes. Dude, I want mashed potatoes now. I'm so hungry. You should have told me I would have picked something up on the way over here. <laughs> He's the best photographer. Three-fourths cups of flour. Okay, I'm gonna have to get a bigger measure for that one. They're like more than you I wish I could get <laughs> us to have the same time. We'll just, we'll just squat the whole time right here. Like, People are gonna roast me so much. Just, might as well just sit down here. <laughs> it was gonna be called How oh, Not yes. to Bake. <laughs> last night and then decided to wait until today to make the frosting so now we're gonna make the frosting but it's very early in the morning so first I'm going to make some coffee and also after we do all the frosting Layla is going to have some food for her six month birthday I know these look gross but they're just red bananas they're still edible and safe for her to eat so we're going to mash them up and make some Banana baby food for this little six month old baby. You're gonna put it back in its heart. Hello, Christmas. Say happy birthday, Layla. Happy birthday. Happy half birthday. We're gonna make some coffee and we'll go to this video. So the 
frosting, all we need to do is add one and a half cups of powdered sugar, a quarter to a half cup of eggnog, and one teaspoon of light caro syrup. You sprinkle nutmeg on the top at the end, just, I guess, to look cute for the flavor. So we have this big thing of powdered sugar, some eggnog that we also used in the cookies last night, and yeah, this caro syrup. We use this. I toasted you guys down a little bit so you can see what's going on down here. One and a half cups of powdered sugar. So they look a little messy right now, but I think they're gonna look really cool once this frosting sort of hardens. It wasn't a totally failed mission. They definitely did not turn out how they looked on Pinterest. But I'll leave you guys a link if you guys want to try making these eggnog cookies because they do taste very good. They're extremely awesome. Now while we let these cookies dry, we're going to feed Layla some mashed banana for her six month birthday. <gasps> Yay! And Layla's about to eat her. Oh! Layla's about to eat her special mashed banana baby food that Sophie just made for her. Is that tasty? You like it? Oh! So she's sitting in this little bouncy seat right now because we don't have a high chair for her because she just. She's wearing this adorable little Tis the Season to Sparkle bib from Logan's mom. So while Sophie is feeding Layla her mashed bananas, I'm just going to give you guys a little six month update on Layla. She is getting very close to calling you guys. She can set up, by herself. She can set up completely by herself and um, you guys might have seen on my Instagram story that I posted a little video where she is like scooting herself backwards around the room. And we're also getting ready for her first Christmas. so. Lots of milestones here. So is getting pretty close to saying mama. She says it like usually just when she's mad. Like she screams and cries and says mama sometimes. <laughs> so that's about it. So yeah, now that Layla's eating some solid food, we're gonna try to give her more solid foods like every day, hopefully. So if he has a little schedule right now where she has like banana week and then apple week and then sweet potato week and I don't know what else she the has. Apple. Wow, you are a mess. You enjoyed those bananas. Well, thank you, Aunt Sophie, for making her this food. Do you want to say goodbye to the video? Goodbye.